that 4 p.m. mark on Tuesday and got a call saying I was claimed by the Titans and I just couldn't be more excited. I'm really happy to be here. What have you heard about this team and maybe the Mike Rabel culture here? I mean, it's just hard-nosed football. I mean, I'm excited to play, you know, guys that come to work every single day and want, and want to work hard. I want to put in the hours to be a really great football team, so I'm just excited to be there. I'm just obviously thrown into the fire today, kind of just learning everything on the fly and, and just rolling with it, but yeah, it's it's been fun so far. I know you've had a lot of experience on the right side, but how, how do you feel when you switch over to the left? Do you feel like you've picked that up, and what's been maybe the hardest thing? Yeah, no, definitely. I, I, uh, I feel like, obviously, yeah, most of my experience is on the right side, but I've been able to get um, a few more starts in there uh, this season, too, as well as last year, so... I'm feeling good about it. Feel really good about either side and my ability to contribute wherever, um, wherever I can, and help this team win football games. Pretty much been exclusively a guard since you got to the NFL. Since yeah, yeah. Basically, once I started actually playing and starting, yeah, I've just played guard in the NFL, but bounced around at, at the tackle spots and a little bit of center too in the training camp kind of OTA type practices. But yeah. What uh, do you know anybody here? Do you walk in the door and know anybody? I knew names, but I, don't, I didn't know anybody like personally. Personally, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. This challenge with this Jaguars offense. I would say um, that they have a lot of weapons. On I wouldn't say they just only have like one guy, and they're not big or physical guys. They're more like quick guys who especially have a yak yards, can run out the catching yards and everything. And it's just quick guys. So I basically say that. This, this is a good offense that people have to pay attention to and target and make sure that we pay attention to lock in on. Did you learn some stuff from Evan Ingram last year in that first game? I think you guys played against uh, them. He kind of went off. And, and just terms mm. of he's more of a yak guy, too. Mm. Is that really? Who is that? Evan Ingram. Oh, Evan Ingram. Yeah, yeah most definitely. On, you know, he made um, a lot of big plays last year, but I don't feel like he would be the only player now. You know, they have Kevin really bad, right. so I feel like they're more happy to have him bad. They're going to try to get the balls in his hands. You know, Christian Kurt, that's the guy they always want to get the ball to and eat him on showing up and catching yards too now. So I just feel like it's more than one guy with this offense. So we just have to lock in and make sure we match up the right people.